Good morning, everybody. Michael from Attention to Detail. Timber is uh, checking out the car today. We're going to call this Resurrection Video. It's a friend of mine's car. She's original owner, I believe. It's got 128,000 miles on it. It's kind of been in storage for a while. Top's nice and dusty. One seat is is gone, the leather. It's an Arizona car, so it's had a lot of heat. Do a quick inside. We're also going to uh, do a full detail on it. She's gonna sell it. So we'll, uh, we'll do the engine bay as, as well. You can see the leathers, door panels. Seat's gone on that side. We got some seat covers for it. Six, 3.5 liter. All right, let the fun begin. All right, just a quick video. You've seen it before in one of my other videos. I do have several different cleaning products that I can use for this, all-purpose cleaners. Um, I saw a video on YouTube, a guy used this product from Armor All, which is the only product from Armor All I use. Uh, the rest of it is not my favorite, if you know what I mean. It's a spray wash, no hose or bucket. So it's like a basically a uh, uh, washless wash in a uh, aerosol. So I just spray it on pretty heavy. Uh, don't soak the electrical parts. We're going to get a new can here. There we go. That'll foam up real good. Sorry if I cut the video off there then I'm just gonna agitate the um, <clears throat> the loose dirt and I'll wipe it off my microfiber <clears throat> I'll follow it up with uh, don't have too many products do I my aerospace 303 UV protectant and uh, we'll follow up so the rims are really kicked on um, so with them being coated and some coating gone, you know, I don't want to go too harsh of a chemical on it, um, for the outside is, is definitely clean. So I'm going to give a rinse of the car, get any bird droppings and stuff off. And, um, then I'm going to show you how to clean the convertible top. We'll be back. So, I'm going to lightly rinse the uh, cloth top off. I'm going to put the uh, Chemical Guys Convertible Top Cleaner. Works on all convertibles. Stain remover, surface cleaner. 
on top afterwards. So let's see how this works. This soap is pretty concentrated, so you don't need to spray a ton on it. Um, I think this is the first bottle I got. I've probably done four, so maybe about a you know third or quarter of the bottle. Just get a nice even coating. I think we got a little tear there. All right, so I'm gonna agitate it with a very soft bristle brush. Let me go grab that. Timber says hi. My uh, garage is a, a mess. I've done back-to-back -back details. So now I'm just gonna just lightly agitate that soap in there. If there was a stain, I would just focus on that stain area, put a little more, you know, spot, spot clean it. But I have found that this stuff works amazing. They also have a protectant that goes with it. So if you wanted to tape it off and, and give it a nice, uh, like a uh, waterproofing, that's also available, their protectant. I get all my all my products, like the brushes, I mean, they have everything. Detail Garage in Mesa, Arizona. Three locations. They have a curbside pickup right now. All right, that's it. Let's rinse it off. Not hard. So what I'm going to do after this, I'm going to uh, foam bath it, clay bar it, and then we'll dry it and we'll come back and do a follow up and see what the top looks like. Here's the after. We got our rims pretty clean. I did a uh, Manzerna 400 
had a lot of scratches. You saw how I cleaned, put a protectant on the top, looks nice and shiny. There's still some etching, you know, it's not perfect, but it is very nice and clean now. Ready to sell some nice young high school kid will get it and work on it and it'll be fantastic for him. You can see the leather came out much cleaner. Got some seat covers for it already. Carpet's nice and clean. She is ready. Questions on detailing? Detailing in Tempe at gmail.com. Don't forget to subscribe to that YouTube channel and smash that like button, everybody. This is uh, five days straight of detailing. Add attention to detail in Tempe. Have a good day.